Hello and welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you how you can add payment methods on your Shopify store. Now this is very simple and easy to do so make sure you watch this video right until the end so that you don't miss any steps. So the first thing you want to do is actually open up the Shopify dashboard like I've done here and we just want to head over to our settings. So in order to actually find our settings we just want to look in the bottom left corner and we will see this settings option with a cog next to it. So when you click on that, it will actually first take you to store details, but we just want to go down a few to payments and then click on that and you will be on a page that looks something like this. Now what we do from here will depend on what type of payment method you are trying to add. So I'm just going to go through all the most important ones now. So if you have Shopify payments turned on, it will actually accept all of these cards here and also a few other things such as Shop Pay and Apple Pay and Google Pay. Now Shopify payments is pretty good for covering most stuff, however you may not want to do it through Shopify payments so we can add some more providers and also some additional payment methods if that's what we wanted to do. So in order to actually do that we would have to scroll down a bit to where it says additional payment methods. So as you can see we can actually add PayPal down here so, so you will actually have to click this complete account setup button down here. And then from there, you will have to actually log into your PayPal account. And then from there, you can connect it with your Shopify. And then you can actually start taking payments. And then you can actually start taking payments via PayPal, which is kind of cool. A lot of people use and trust PayPal. So it would be a good thing to have added into your store. Now, there's also Amazon Pay down here as well. So in order to activate that, do the same thing. You just have to click this. And obviously, you have to register as a merchant for Amazon Pay. So that can be another good thing to actually set up for your store. Now, some people would like to actually do different payment providers. So instead of using Shopify payments, you might want to use Stripe. So in order to actually do that, you will actually have to turn off Shopify payments because Shopify are trying to push Shopify payments to everyone. So they're kind of hiding Stripe away. You will actually have to turn off Shopify payments if you would rather do Stripe. However, if you're not too worried about Stripe, you just want some different card providers under here. We can also do that as well. First, we want to go down a bit to this additional payment methods again. And then we want to look for add payment methods. So when we click on that and search in here, we will actually be able to search for tons of payment methods. So here we can see all those credit cards that are covered under Shopify payments. However, if we just go down a bit more, there is actually some other stuff that we can add. So here you can see there's Clearpay and Klarna. So this will allow people to buy it and then pay it back later, which is kind of cool. And it could really help your conversion rate. Now, there is also cryptocurrency under here as well. So if you had, so if you wanted to enable payments via Ethereum, for example, we can click on Ethereum. And then we can choose one of these providers and click activate. And then we want to go through the process of actually setting this up for our store. So you can basically add anything you like. You just basically want to search in here what type of payment method you actually want to add. And then you can click on it and then follow the instructions on screen in order to actually add it to your Shopify store. So that is exactly how you can add payment methods to your Shopify store. I hope you found this video helpful. And if you did, please comment down below to say this video helped you out. And like and subscribe for more content like this. Thank you for watching.